Sleeves here. Going to be doing an overnight this weekend. This is uh, the spring equinox, and uh, this evening it's going to uh, change from winter to spring. So I'm looking forward to that. I know I'll have a, a great uh, weekend here at Dally Gap in the Cahutta Wilderness. From uh, the Gap, I'm going to be taking Hemp Top Trail over to Penitentiary Branch, and from Penitentiary Branch going down to Jack's River. Be doing an overnight there, uh, a little hammocking, and uh, in the morning we'll be taking Jack's River or Jack's River Trail back up to uh, the Dally Gap. I think the, the loop is about 12 to 13 miles. The weather's not the best. Uh, cloud layer is pretty low, and it actually cleared out right here at the Gap when I parked. But uh, it's going to be a little foggy, a little overcast, and uh, misty. So it's going to be a little damp, but uh, temperatures in the low low 40s, upper 30s, maybe somewhere in that neighborhood. Uh, I know it'll be a good one. It's going to be a great time, and uh, I'll be checking back. I really think this is a, a beautiful spot, and uh, I know it's going to be great. I look forward to it, and it'll be a good night. Camping here next to Penitentiary Branch. Penitentiary Branch makes its way about a quarter mile, three tenths, something like that, I'm down the trail. And Penitentiary Branch Trail follows, uh, of course, the stream, but uh, it empties into uh, Jack's River and then goes on down to the falls. I imagine with all the water today that uh, the falls are beautiful, I'm sure. beautiful place to camp. I know I'll enjoy it and look forward to a good night. Kind of perched up on the hill there. I decided to set it up up there instead of uh, down here. I hung my uh, food. We'll see. Do I think that this will keep a bear out of my food? Uh, if the bear wanted the food, I imagine the bear would get it. I think it just gives me something to do in the evening. Anyway, hopefully uh, it'll be there in the morning. I survived the night, and it was indeed a dark night. <laughs> no moon, no moonshine at all. Interesting. It was a very dark night, and... Uh, good one slept well my uh, hammock and under quilt kept me warm and uh, very good rest so I'm ready for the hike out I think we've got uh, several river crossings today so uh, that'll be a good one I made it to Jack's River this is the uh, first of many crossings, and uh, it's going to be a wet day. I think there's several. I'm looking for this blaze, as you see behind me. That's the blaze that's uh, giving me the direction, so hopefully I can find them. But here, here we are, about to start it. It's a good day. Looks like it's going to be a nice day, sun's out today. 
So that'd be that'd be nice. Well, one thing is for sure, that water is cold. I've done uh, three crossings at this point, and uh, my feet are freezing. Pretty trail. A few fallen logs that have uh, started to decay. But overall, very pretty through these uh, this little valley here. But I'll check back at the next crossing. something else. This one uh, across just below these little falls here. A lot of water moving. Uh, it's moving pretty fast. You can see the blue blaze across the way there on that tree. That's the uh, direction that I just came from. About to uh, Head up the trail right here. Pretty little falls. Well, this trail heads along Jack's River here. And I believe I got a couple more, if not three, more crossings to go. But a uh, beautiful spot. The weather's really nice. Uh, blue sky. I imagine it is in the 50s by now, low 50s anyway. And uh, very pretty day. I know uh, the rest of my hike will be great. Need a little campsite here.
Wow, it's just beautiful here. Jack's River. Cahutta Wilderness. You need to check it out. here in the cut of wilderness came in at you know I don't know if you call it daily or daily but anyway it's uh you can call it daily gap or daily gap and uh, took camp top over the penitentiary branch uh, trail and then uh, from there I uh, had an overnight there on the penitentiary branch and then uh, took uh, Jack's River back to uh, Dally Gap. It was a uh, it was a nice nice time. I enjoyed it. Rained all day yesterday, so I got to test my gear. Everything held up nicely. It was actually cold last night. It was it was very chilly, and uh, today wow, it's turned out to be beautiful. Take a look at the sun. So the weather, I think it's probably in the uh, in the 60s now. So it's pretty pretty warm. Well, let me tell you, if you have not experienced Jack's River Trail, 
from Penitentiary Branch. I was told, or I read, that there's 18 river crossings. Well, there is a lot of water moving today, and fast. So I had, uh, I had a tough time coming out. A lot of river crossings, and uh, I lost count, so I'm not sure if there's 18 or not. It was a great time. If you haven't hiked in the Cahuta Wilderness, you need to do it. Keep hiking. Till next time. Just a follow up on my overnight hike in the Cutter Wilderness. I will caution anyone that's going to take this loop that I, I mentioned. Uh, make sure you're prepared. If you go in the summertime when there's not uh, when there's not been much uh, rain, you should be okay. But uh, if you choose to go after a a lot of rain, just be prepared for water. You're going to have uh, multiple crossings on Jack's River and I'm talking waist deep not uh, not ankle and knee and it is rather swift so just be careful and uh, but enjoy. Go ahead of wilderness. You need to do it.